Welcome to flickmyproject.com. The project title is Identifying Life Scrines Using Image Analysis and Sparse Representation Based Classification. The project abstract is Rice Crane images were acquired by microscopy. The morphological, color, and textural traits of the grain body, sterile, lemos, and brush were quantified and SVM and KNN classifier was subsequently developed to identify the varieties of the grains using the traits as the inputs. The proposed approach plowed discriminate rice grains varieties with an accuracy of 89.1%. The project flow diagram is to recognize the shape for rice grain images and improve the accuracy rate. Our input image was variety of rice grain images. On that image we choose one input image. After read our input image, we are applying the pre-processing for image resize, gray conversion, binary conversion and filtering. In filtering to remove the noise for corresponding images. Next we have to segment the image and before segmentation we have to cluster that image. After applying clustering model, we have to extract the features by using HOG and shift. Next we have to classify the all images by using above the process. In that classification, we use two, two methods. First one is SVM, that means support vector machine, and second one is KNN classification. In KNN means nearest neighbor. Finally, to recognize the image and calculate the accuracy rate, our project source code file was run from the command window. In current folder shows the our source code file. So in that source code file, we have to select the main file.m it is our source code file so we have to choose the main.m file to run the process will be going on it is the data set to select the our input image there are five images are there we have to select any one of the image according to that image the process will be going on In command window shows the enter the image number of clustered image. In that image there are four number four different type of images. We have to choose the exact segmented our input image. In cluster image three is the exact segmented image. So we have to enter the three. Finally, we calculate our accuracy result. In figure 1 shows the our input image. It is our input image. In figure 2 shows the after getting our input image, we have to resize the our input image for our convenience. In figure 3 shows the filtered image. In that filtered image, we have to reduce the noise for our input image. In figure 5 shows that the after gray conversion, we have to convert the binary conversion image. It is our binary image. In figure 6, after conversion of binary, we have to segment the exact region of our object. It is our segmented image. In figure 7 shows that the we have to apply the color enhancement for exact region of our object. In figure 8 shows that the image adjusts. It is to extract the features of our gray conversion of image. It is the local area region to extract the object. In figure 9 shows that the history cube method it is to plot the extract region for gray and binary. In figure in figure 10 shows that the to apply the clustering model of our input image after the pre-processing. In figure 11 shows that the clustered image index 
it is the how much regions are occupied the corresponding object and to segment the image in figure 12 shows that the four number of subplots are there in cluster one images to segment the our image for color enhancement in object are shown in the black color and background will be on colored in cluster two image like that like that the four images different images are there in that clustered image we have to choose the exact clustered image in clustered image 3 is the exact region of our object so we have to choose the 3 to get our result after getting our clustered image 3 we have to apply the hog feature extraction it is the hog feature extraction for our extracted cluster image in figure 14 shows the shift feature extraction for our after clustered image in corresponding image the name of the object will be shown on the label by using on svm classification it is the accuracy graph for our svm classification method in x label shows the classification and y label shows the accuracy it is the corresponding image for knn classification to apply it is the accuracy graph for our knn classification method in x label shows the classification and y label shows the accuracy so like that we have to choose the image and verify the accuracy level the project demo was completed thanks to watching this video